Dollarama pack attacks. That's right. We got a bunch of stuff from the dollar store today. And we're going to open these up right now, right here on the Proco Taco Show. Stay tuned. The Proco Taco Show. What is going on you guys? Proco Taco here with the Proco Taco Show. And on today's episode, we have a bunch of stuff from Dollarama, like I just mentioned in that intro. Um, so we got four packs of random hockey cards, 15 cards in each pack. Um, decided to pick these up because some of these cards look pretty cool. Look at that, Chris Pronger there in the Team Canada uniform, Stammer, Anderson, Colorado. Um, we'll put those to the side. And then we also got some uh, 2.5 inch figurines. So that there's actually quite a few of these to collect if you have a look at the back here. There's the commons. And you have your uncommons and your rare rares. All-star edition Pecorine. Um, they are pretty cool. I've opened up one of these before. But I saw these at Dollarama and I decided to buy four of them to share with you guys on the show. So without further ado, let's get on with the show. So we'll open up figurine number one. Just rips right open like that. And our figurine is, I think this is Eric Carlson. Let's go ahead and take it out and build it so you guys can see what it looks like. And this guy is a limited edition here. Oh no, this isn't Carlson. This is Stone. This is Mark Stone, number 61. Let's get his hockey stick. Come on, Stone. Grab your stick, bud. We gotta play some hockey, bud. The season's upon us, buddy. Come on, guy. Just the stick doesn't want to get in there. There we go. And see if we can fit it through his second glove here. Mr. Stone doesn't seem to be ready for the hockey season. He's forgotten how to grip. A hockey stick anyways you guys get the gist of it there's your mark stone figurine pretty cool um, I believe like there's some game to this I don't really know how to play this or whatever it is but if you know feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below and then there's a piece of paper here one side again has that checklist of all the figurines and it kind of just explains everything and then you have your six inch figurines which are actually pretty cool um, but yeah I think this is the instructions here of how to play the game with that card but uh, we won't get into that for now uh, we'll just keep opening up these packs and see which figurines we get so we got an Arizona player here, and I believe this is Anthony Duclair. This is actually, I had previously opened one of these up, and this is who I had gotten, Anthony Duclair. So, and he's a rookie. Duclair is a rookie in this set, so I'm guessing this is the 2016 figurines. I'm guessing they sold these in stores um, before they put them at Dollarama. I didn't really see them anywhere. Maybe Toys R Us had them. If you've seen these in stores before, let me know. So there's our Duclair. Put them right beside Stone. Let's open up our third figurine here. Hopefully we don't get any doubles on this episode at least. Got a Nashville player here. Number 9. Forsberg. That's a pretty cool one. Let's put him on his uh, on his little display stand here, which is shaped like a puck. How isn't that something? I'm thinking I should probably put the stick in their hands first. Might make it a bit easier because then the puck isn't in the way. Okay, that. 
And bim -ba. There you go. Forsberg is ready for the hockey season, ladies and gentlemen. Smash reel here. Okay. It's a nice little figurine, right? Pretty cool. Um, so let's go ahead and open up our last one here and then we'll clean up this messy area. Yes, we got a maple leaf! Ah! Tyler Bozak! Yes, that's actually so sweet. Right in the last uh, last package. Let's see if Bozak is ready for the hockey season. I hope so, bud. Playing with uh, Austin Matthews. On the same squad. Not on the same lineup, but... Bozak, he's almost ready. He's almost ready! Bozak's ready for the hockey season. He's ready to play for Mike Babcock. In Toronto Maple Leafs. Let's put him on his hockey puck. These figurines are actually pretty cool. Look at that. Bozak. Looks like he's taking a face off there. Very nice. Super, super sweet. And of course, then you have their player cards here, right? Um, that I guess you play that game with. We'll put those to the side. And we'll clean up the desk here because we got a lot of crap. We'll just throw that right on the floor right now. I'll clean that up later. And uh, we'll get on to the second half here of our, uh, of our opening. We'll open up those, uh, those random packs of hockey cards. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to save everybody some time. Cut all four packs open right now all at once. Just like that. You see that, guys? That's how you open up hockey cards. Let's go straight into pack number one here. Okay? Upper deck rookie portraits. Sonny Milano. Petri Shriko. Bowman hockey card. That's from the 90s. Here we have a Mighty Ducks checklist from Parkhurst. Uh, when's this from? It doesn't say on here actually. That's pretty weird. It doesn't say what year this card is from. It just says Parkhurst since 1951. Anyways, uh, this card seems to be from 92, 93. Raymond Hilger. Central Red Army checklist. Lots of random stuff in here, right? Mark Andre Fleury. <laughs> Top prospects. That's pretty cool in the game. Then we have a captain's card of Lionel Hitchman with Bruins. This I think is an original six uh, Parkhurst card in the game. Steve Casper, Randy Mahler, score, Tony Granado, uh, Kevin Dinden, Dindin, Zarli. Zalapski, Adam Graves, then we got Dennis Bonvi, an OHL card, and Craig Anderson, stars of the game from between the pipes with Colorado. So lots of uh, 90s cards in there, and 90s cards are fairly inexpensive due to the mass productions of hockey cards in that uh, era. Philip Forsberg. That's why some people call it like 90s junk. Like rookie cards from then are worth like a dollar, two, three, four, five dollars max, really. Um, Shane Corson. There's a checklist for your capitals, very similar to that Mighty Ducks checklist. Star rookies of Marty McInnes. And we got a uh, Tom Tilly. Another captain's car. This one is a Ray Borg. That's a pretty nice one. So you can find some really cool stuff. Again, probably not a lot of value to them since you're paying a dollar for all 15 of these cards. But you know, it's a cool card. Like if you collect Ray Borg, there's a cool card to add to your collection. Uh, Gary Smith between the pipes. Tom Barrasso. 
top prospect of Mark Craig. Again, lots and lots of 90s cards. These are all 90s. This is 9091. Craig Mooney. Todd Bertuzzi. <laughs> the Islanders. Look at that retro logo. That retro jersey there. This is a Bertuzzi rookie card, actually. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. Todd Bertuzzi. I'm going to put this one to the side. I like this card. I like this retro Islanders logo. It's really cool. Put that to the side. Uh, Bob Rose, Maple Leafs Pro Set. So that's this, this is from '91. Grant Ledyard, and then we got uh, Robert Frain, OHL card, and uh, Chris Pronger. This is why I bought this pack. This really nice card. I love the uniform. Chris Pronger, pretty cool. Uh, so this one, I think it was the. The OPG Platinum that made me want to buy it. I know it's a base, but Victor Ask here. 1516. Oh, 1617 actually. That thought it was 1516 for a second. Um, and then we got some of our older guys Pat Verbeek, Whalers, Eric Weinrich, uh, Russian Stars Checklist. Checklist on the back there. Ed Belfour. Uh, Premier OPG 92. So this this set with Ed Belfour um, is kind of actually what got me back into collecting. Um, and I think I need literally one card to finish this set. And I know it's not an expensive set to finish, but I actually bought packs and tried to collect it. Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Love this, uh, love this set personally. Um, then we got here Sean Burke, uh, Jeff Carter, OHL grad, Janardina, Momenta, Cam Neely, Bam, Crunch Chew. <laughs> That's a pretty cool card. Uh, Peter Zirowicz. Phil Housley, Mike Lowler, the Jets card here, Craig Mills, uh, Craig Brocklehurst, OHL, and uh, Providence Bruins, AHL, Heroes and Prospects, Maxim Suave. Put that to the side, and we'll go into our last Dollarama pack here. And then we'll be done with today's episode. So, uh, series one or two. Series one base. Dominic Lavot. And then we got Nolan Baumgartner. I really like this Parker set. I wish it said uh, what year it's from. If you know, leave a comment in the comment section below. It's really cool looking. Yes, it's, I'm guessing it's from the 90s somewhere. Pat Verbeek. Phil Boucher, and then here's another OPG Premier from 92, Kelly Kisio, and then we got uh, 2002 Signature Series, Yuri Fisher, and see no signature, bud. Uh, top Prospects game, Boris Valadik. Canadians team card from Tops from the 90s. Uh, 8990 final standing, so 1990 exactly, I believe this card would be from. And Bruce Driver. Uh, collector's Choice art card of Mark Messier. It's actually the checklist card. Pretty cool. Uh, Mike Laller. Got an Adam Oates card here. This, oh, I thought this was Paul Curry. I saw Mighty Ducks. Sean Van Allen. And our OHL card, Killy the Pond. And our last card, OPG card of Steven Stamkos. So that concludes today's break. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was a bit different with our uh, little figurines and our Dollarama packs. If you enjoyed that, 
make sure you click that like button as that really helps me out and if you want to see more cool episodes just like this i would love to have you subscribe so if you click that subscribe button you'll get updates and uh, notifications whenever a new episode is posted um, so you'll be the first to watch it right um, so thanks for tuning in guys uh, let me know in the comment section if you enjoyed um, seeing these figurines being opened up and if you think we should try and collect all of them because they do make for a nice little collection to have all right guys so thanks once again for tuning in and until next time peace out crackle tackle thanks for watching to watch another episode click one of the rectangles make sure you check me out on twitter instagram and facebook and don't forget to subscribe guys i know you want to